Your adventure begins here at Harley Davidson of Charlotte, located in Matthews. Visit hdcharlotte.com to learn how to put easy back in Easy Street and register for a free VIP Harley Davidson experience. Here we go, here we go, Tom Ziggler, Coke Mill, ringside. <laughs> HD Fight Series. Man. Charlotte, North Carolina. Harley Davidson of Charlotte. Next fight, Matthew Grant making his way to the cage. The tender age of 18. A youngin coming to the cage, man. 2-0 though. He's the youngin with some experience, Tom. 2-0, 5'8", 155 pounds, fighting out of North Carolina. Oh, don't let, don't let it fool you. His first fight was an elite championship cage fighting back in March. And for the first probably minute of that fight, he was getting manhandled by his opponent. And then next thing you know, they got to their feet. Boom, overhand right, knockout. He went on to go ahead and submit a very impressive Brad Roof, who you and I have trained with in the past. Yes. So this kid, he's no joke. He's on a 2-0 win streak, just 18 years old. The real deal, 18. We're going to see what he has tonight. He gets a win here tonight. He'll be talked about for amateur title shots for sure. Oh, most definitely, most definitely. He come in looking really confident, man. Let's yeah, wins will do that to you. When you're winning, that confidence level soars. Now, he's fighting Rashad Hood, who's making his way down the walk now. Rashad Hood's 31 years old. Grown man. He's a grown man. <laughs> grown man. That's what I'm saying. Coming in at two and one. Another, that's an impressive record. That's a winning record. Two and one, five, six, 145 pounds, coming out of Georgia. Yeah. We're seeing some brawls, man. Like you said, North Carolina and Georgia, we're, we're going at it tonight. Yeah, he's got uh, two wins against Danny Burns and Joe Gibbs. And then he went to Wild Bill's Fight Night. It always has great fights down in Atlanta. And he experienced his first loss against Tempers Davis. He's looking to get back on the win streak here tonight. And uh, he's got a uh, tall order in his hand, Matthew Grant. That's a confident young man. But like we said, if you're 31 years old, you know, you got your man strength. Yeah, and we're right. He, he has his old man. He's gonna pull out the old man strength card tonight. And see what happens. Both very impressive records, man. I'm really excited to see what's gonna happen with this fight. Yeah, there's uh, lots of talk, lots of uh, uh, chatter and buzz about this fight here on the main card. Uh, two up and coming amateurs uh, that have shown a lot of skill in their previous fights. Now, Rashad Hood, I mean, you can't make up a better name than Rashad Hood. It looks like you made up that name. He, he didn't make it up. <laughs> he was born with it. <laughs> his, mom, hey, his mama gave him that name. <laughs> that name is Mama Gable. Well, he's coming in, and he is looking like a bad boy. Yeah, he's a big, thick specimen of a man there. Shorter in stature, but uh, heavily, heavily muscled. We're going to see if the... North Carolina crowd letting the Georgia boy know about it. <laughs> Rashad Hood seems unfazed whatsoever. This is going to be very interesting, man. We're going to see the young, full of energy guy, the beast coming to play, man. Yeah, he's a, he's a big boy. Not exactly sure how he made this weight class. <laughs> Here we go with round number one. Coming from where I'm from, we'll say that boy big. <laughs> 
Good body shot from Grant. He's showing that power. Oh! Donnie oh, Jessup has seen it enough. Knocks him out! <laughs> knocks him out! Donnie Jessup has seen it enough. Matthew Grant with a flurry. Wow! He showed what hand speed. He showed a very quick hand. It was a good body shot with a kick to the body. Now Rashad Hood is not happy about it, but he's still walking kind of gingerly. Now there was a moment in time after those blows, Rashad Hood did go flat on his stomach, okay? Donnie Jessup saw that and moved in to stop the fight. As controversial as it may seem to the Georgia fans and the Rashad Hood fans, yes. Donnie Jessup's first priority is the safety of the fighters from his vantage point. The shot hood did go limp. May have been a flash knockdown, may have been a slip, but from the referee's vantage point, he wanted to protect the fighter. What a flurry by Matthew Grant. And a lot of times, you, you, we have to understand, these are human beings in this case. They are men with families. So you have to protect them. Protection and, and safety has to be key in any type of combat sport, especially at the amateur level. You know, there's not a lot of history on these guys and the type of punishment they can take. You may see UFC fighters, the referee let it go because the guy has a reputation of being able to take punishment. You know, at the end of the day, these are, these are young guys. They are amateurs. They are not professionals. They are not making money for this. They have to go home to see their family. They have to go to work uh, to, to put food on the table for their families. Their Most safety definitely. Most is definitely. the number one priority. Now, there's a little bit of a protest from uh, Hood's camp. Donnie Jessup is explaining to him what he saw and why he made the decision. But Matthew Grant, this kid, he's got something. Something. He he has the it factor. The it factor, <laughs> as they like to call it. And he showed it, man. He came in 18 years of age. He came in very confident off a two-win streak here. Two wins in a row. And he came in very confident, man, and he showed it. He sure and displayed did. his talents tonight. Very accurate, fast hands. Nice flurry to finish the fight. Referee Donnie Jessup holds this up at 14 seconds of the opening round to the strikes. Your winner of ITKO, Matt. Matthew Grant with another impressive victory. Very impressive victory, Matthew Grant. HD Fight Series.